Rutherfordium is a synthetic chemical element with symbol RF and atomic number 104, named after physicist Ernest Rutherford. As a synthetic element, it is not found in nature and can only be created in a laboratory. It is radioactive. The most stable known isotope, 267 RF, has a half life of approximately 1.3 hours. In the periodic table of the elements, it is a D block element and the second of the fourth row transition elements. It is a member of the seventh period and belongs to the group four elements. Chemistry experiments have confirmed that Rutherfordium behaves as the heavier homologue to hafnium in group four. The chemical properties of Rutherfordium are characterized only partly. They compare well with the chemistry of the other group four elements, even though some calculations had indicated that the element might show significantly different properties due to relativistic effects. In the 1960s, small amounts of Rutherfordium were produced in the Joint Institute for Nuclear Research in the former Soviet Union and at Lawrence Berkeley National Laboratory in California. The priority of the discovery and therefore the naming of the element was disputed between Soviet and American scientists, and it was not until 1997 that International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry established Rutherfordium as the official name for the element. History <inaudible> Discovery Rutherfordium was reportedly first detected in 1964 at the Joint Institute of Nuclear Research at Dubna then in the Soviet Union. Researchers there bombarded a plutonium-242 target with neon-22 ions and separated the reaction products by gradient thermochromatography after conversion to chlorides by interaction with zirconium chloride. The team identified spontaneous fission activity contained within a volatile chloride portraying aca hafnium properties. Although a half-life was not accurately determined, later calculations indicated that the product was most likely Rutherfordium-259 abbreviated as 259 RF in standard notation. 24,294 Pu plus 2,210 Ne 264 minus X 104 RF 264 minus X 104 RF Cl4 In 1969, researchers at the University of California, Berkeley conclusively synthesized the element by bombarding a Californium-249 target with carbon-12 ions and measured the alpha decay of 257 RF, correlated with the daughter decay of Nobelium-250 2,4998 CF plus 126 C 257,104 RF plus 4 NTHE American synthesis was independently confirmed in 1973 and secured the identification of Rutherfordium as the parent by the observation of K-alpha X-rays in the elemental signature of the 257 RF decay product, Nobelium-253. Naming controversy The Russian scientists proposed the name Kerchatovium and the American scientists suggested the name Rutherfordium for the new element. In 1992, the IUPAC, IUPAP Transfermium Working Group TWG assessed the claims of discovery and concluded that both teams provided contemporaneous evidence to the synthesis of element 104 and that credit should be shared between the two groups. The American group wrote a scathing response to the findings of the TWG, stating that they had given too much emphasis on the results from the Dubna group. In particular they pointed out that the Russian group had altered the details of their claims several times over a period of 20 years, a fact that the Russian team does not deny. They also stressed that the TWG had given too much credence to the chemistry experiments performed by the Russians and accused the TWG of not having appropriately qualified personnel on the committee. The TWG responded by saying that this was not the case and having assessed each point raised by the American group said that they found no reason to alter their conclusion regarding priority of discovery. The IUPAC finally used the name suggested by the American team, Rutherfordium, which may in some way reflect a change of opinion, as a consequence of the initial competing claims of discovery, an element naming controversy arose. Since the Soviets claimed to have first detected the new element they suggested the name Kerchatovium in honor of Igor Kurchatov former head of Soviet nuclear research. 
This name had been used in books of the Soviet bloc as the official name of the element. The Americans, however, proposed Rutherfordium RF for the new element to honor Ernest Rutherford, who is known as the father of nuclear physics. The International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry IUPAC adopted Unnilquadium UNQ as a temporary, systematic element name, derived from the Latin names for digits 1, 0, and 4. In 1994, IUPAC suggested the name Dubnium D -flat to be used since Rutherfordium was suggested for element 106 and IUPAC felt that the Dubna team should be rightly recognized for their contributions. However, there was still a dispute over the names of elements 104 to 107. In 1997 the teams involved resolved the dispute and adopted the current name Rutherfordium. The name Dubnium was given to element 105 at the same time. Isotopes Rutherfordium has no stable or naturally occurring isotopes. Several radioactive isotopes have been synthesized in the laboratory, either by fusing two atoms or by observing the decay of heavier elements. Sixteen different isotopes have been reported with atomic masses from 253 to 270 with the exceptions of 264 and 269. Most of these decay predominantly through spontaneous fission pathways. Lifetimes Out of isotopes whose half-lives are known, the lighter isotopes usually have shorter half-lives, half-lives of under 50 microseconds for 253 RF and 254 RF were observed. 256 RF, 258 RF, 260 RF are more stable at around 10 milliseconds, 255 RF, 257 RF, 259 RF, and 262 RF live between 1 and 5 seconds, and 261 RF, 265 RF, and 263 RF are more stable, at around 1, 1 1.5, and 10 minutes respectively. The heaviest isotopes are the most stable, with 267 RF having a measured half-life of about 1.3 h. Half lives for 269 RF, 271 RF, and higher are not known and have not yet been predicted. The lightest isotopes were synthesized by direct fusion between two lighter nuclei and as decay products. The heaviest isotope produced by direct fusion is 262 RF. Heavier isotopes have only been observed as decay products of elements with larger atomic numbers, of which only 267 RF has been confirmed. The heavy isotopes 266 RF and 268 RF have also been observed as electron capture daughters of the dubnium isotopes 266 D flat and 268 D flat, but have short half lives to spontaneous fission. It seems likely that the same is true of 270 RF, a likely daughter of 270 D flat. While the isotope 264 RF has yet to be observed, it is predicted to have a short half life of 5s. In 1999, American scientists at the University of California, Berkeley, announced that they had succeeded in synthesizing three atoms of 293 Og. These parent nuclei were reported to have successively emitted seven alpha particles to form 265 RF nuclei, but their claim was retracted in 2001. Predicted properties Chemical Rutherfordium is the first transactinide element and the second member of the 6D series of transition metals. Calculations on its ionization potentials, atomic radius, as well as radii, orbital energies, and ground levels of its ionized states are similar to that of hafnium and very different from that of lead. Therefore, it was concluded that Rutherfordium's basic properties will resemble those of other group 4 elements, below titanium, zirconium, and hafnium. Some of its properties were determined by gas phase experiments and aqueous chemistry. The oxidation state plus 4 is the only stable state for the latter two elements and therefore Rutherfordium should also exhibit a stable plus 4 state. In addition, Rutherfordium is also expected to be able to form a less stable plus 3 state. 
The standard reduction potential of the RF4 plus, RF couple is predicted to be higher than 1.7 V. Initial predictions of the chemical properties of Rutherfordium were based on calculations which indicated that the relativistic effects on the electron shell might be strong enough that the 7p orbitals would have a lower energy level than the 6d orbitals, giving it a valence electron configuration of 6d 1727p1 or even 7s27p2, therefore making the element behave more like lead than hafnium. With better calculation methods and experimental studies of the chemical properties of Rutherfordium compounds it could be shown that this does not happen and that Rutherfordium instead behaves like the rest of the group 4 elements, in an analogous manner to zirconium and hafnium, Rutherfordium is projected to form a very stable, refractory oxide, RFO2. It reacts with halogens to form tetrahalides, RFX4, which hydrolyze on contact with water to form oxyhalides RFOX2. The tetrahalides are volatile solids existing as monomeric tetrahedral molecules in the vapor phase. In the aqueous phase, the RF4 plus ion hydrolyzes less than titanium IV and to a similar extent as zirconium and hafnium, thus resulting in the RFO2 plus ion. Treatment of the halides with halide ions promotes the formation of complex ions. The use of chloride and bromide ions produces the hexahalide complexes RFCl2-6 and RFBr2-6. For the fluoride complexes, zirconium and hafnium tend to form hepta and octa complexes. Thus, for the larger Rutherfordium ion, the complexes RFF2-6, RFF3-7 and RFF4-8 are possible. Physical and atomic Rutherfordium is expected to be a solid under normal conditions and assume a hexagonal close-packed crystal structure C, A. Equals 1 .61, similar to its lighter congener hafnium. It should be a very heavy metal with a density of around 23.2 g per cc. In comparison, the densest known element that has had its density measured, osmium, has a density of 22.61 g per cc. This results from Rutherfordium's high atomic weight, the lanthanide and actinide contractions, and relativistic effects, although production of enough Rutherfordium to measure this quantity would be impractical, and the sample would quickly decay. The atomic radius for Rutherfordium is expected to be around 150 pm. Due to the relativistic stabilization of the 7's orbital and destabilization of the 6d orbital, the RF plus and RF2 plus ions are predicted to give up 6d electrons instead of 7's electrons, which is the opposite of the behavior of its lighter homologues. Equals. <laughs> Topic: <laughs> Experimental chemistry. Equals. <laughs> equals equals topic gas phase equals equals early work on the study of the chemistry of rutherfordium focused on gas thermochromatography and measurement of relative deposition temperature adsorption curves the initial work was carried out at dubna in an attempt to reaffirm their discovery of the element Recent work is more reliable regarding the identification of the parent Rutherfordium radioisotopes. The isotope 261 MRF has been used for these studies, though the long-lived isotope 267 RF produced in the decay chains of 291 LV, 287 Florida, and 283 CN may be advantageous for future experiments. The experiments relied on the expectation that Rutherfordium would begin the new 6D series of elements and should therefore form a volatile tetrachloride due to the tetrahedral nature of the molecule. Rutherfordium IV chloride is more volatile than its lighter homologue hafnium IV chloride HFCl4 because its bonds are more covalent. A series of experiments confirmed that Rutherfordium behaves as a typical member of group 4, forming a tetravalent chloride RFCl4 and bromide RFBr4 as well as an oxychloride RFOCl2. A decreased volatility was observed for RFCl4 when potassium chloride is provided as the solid phase instead of gas, highly indicative of the formation of nonvolatile K2 RFCl6 mixed salt. Aqueous phase equals equals 
Rutherfordium is expected to have the electron configuration Rn 5f 14 s 2 and therefore behave as the heavier homologue of hafnium in group 4 of the periodic table. It should therefore readily form a hydrated RF4 plus ion in strong acid solution and should readily form complexes in hydrochloric acid, hydrobromic or hydrofluoric acid solutions. The most conclusive aqueous chemistry studies of Rutherfordium have been performed by the Japanese team at Japan Atomic Energy Research Institute using the isotope 261 MRF. Extraction experiments from hydrochloric acid solutions using isotopes of rutherfordium, hafnium, zirconium, as well as the pseudo-group 4 element thorium have proved a non-actinide behavior for rutherfordium. A comparison with its lighter homologues placed rutherfordium firmly in group 4 and indicated the formation of a hexachlororutherfordate complex in chloride solutions, in a manner similar to hafnium and zirconium. 261 MRF4 plus plus 6 Cl minus 261 MRF Cl6 2 minus very similar results were observed in hydrofluoric acid solutions. Differences in the extraction curves were interpreted as a weaker affinity for fluoride ion and the formation of the hexafluororutherfordate ion, whereas hafnium and zirconium ions complex 7 or 8 fluoride ions at the concentrations used. 261 MRF4 plus plus 6 F minus 261 MRFF6 2 minus equals equals see also